this is the moment. This is the chance that can potentially turn a loser to a billionaire. On April 6th, I have predicted that the crypto market will tank and the altcoin season will end, would end. I was right, completely right. S started from April 6th, the markets, the Bitcoin, crypto, Ethereum, all the coins just go go down, just went down, and uh, like a free, uh, like a like a slow death sort of situation. But right now, right here, there is a poss there is a chance that can turn a complete loser to a complete utter winner of life. And that is investing in Terra Luna right now. After it's that, it's a dead fish, no doubt about it. But at a cheap price right now, Terra Luna can possibly go from zero to hero. Goes from zero to infinity. Not only go goes back to its all-time high previous all-time high, but can all also goes up to 1,000, 10,000, 1 million, or 10 million, or whatever you name it, goes to infinity. Here's why. The reason why Terra Luna has been tanking is because it's padded to UST. And in order to... Um, and the USD has since the USD has departed from the US dollar, the Terra Luna Foundation or whatever Terra Farm or uh, I don't know what what that is. I'm not sure about that, but they have been they have been printing Terra Luna to basically just a as a Federal Reserve as what Federal Reserve does. They're printing money. To support their governments, like the like U.S. debt debt situation, they have been printing money and borrowing more money, and borrowing more money, so that debt just pile to sky high. But on the other hand, they are printing Terra Luna to support the U.S.T. So that's why you don't see, you didn't see U.S.T. like a free fall, but they are like going down. And going up a bit, supporting, and then going down, going went went uh, went up a bit, and they are like zero point three, zero point six. Suddenly go to zero point five. That the sort of situation is because of the support fund by the printing of Terra Luna. But right now, there is a treat from the UST. Uh, official Twitter accounts that they have been haunting the Terra Luna rock and on the other hand that raises a question to me are they going to support UST as they were before by printing Terra Luna and also they were also burning UST in order to support its price. So that is, is they, they want UST to go back to one US dollar by printing Terra Luna and also burning UST. But on uh, May 12, 2022, they have, uh, sorry, I. Uh, let, let me take a look at what's the day. Uh, let's forget about the date. It's just the latest tweet. Uh, like uh, 41 minutes ago. Um, they were announced. Yeah, May 12, 2022. They were announcing that um, they're going to halt the terror validators have decided to halt the terror chain to prevent governance attacks follow severe lunar inflation and significantly reduce cost of attack. Now, now 
the attack we need to understand what those attacks are the attacks are the attacker they are shorting Terra Luna and then because they know for sure that the Terra Luna they are printing Terra Luna to support UST therefore they are always shorting Terra Luna to profit from it on the other hand they may buy UST as well that that's what they do that was I do also because if money are pulling in into Terra Luna uh, you and then the Terra Luna they are diluting so the price is almost uh, 100% drops to zero so that's what I would do in order to uh, get a share of all those uh, printing and get a share of all those additional fund it's like a uh, it's like a fountain pool money uh, water coming out sort of situation and you want to take a cup of uh, water uh, take a cup to the fountain and drink have a drink but now uh, they are hotting the water fountain sort of they are hotting the tower blockchain at the block height of uh, 7 million uh, seven uh seven six zero three seven zero zero and um yeah that that would be the trade that is a very important trade that has uh, uh almost a uh, ten eleven thousand uh likes uh, up to now is the most likable trade uh up up uh for for the past uh, few weeks and that's why it is a very important trade uh is a is a change of paradigm right here for the i mean not for the world but for or not the crypto world but for the terra lunar world uh that's what i would guess what, what they are going to do in the future um they are not going to print terra lunar anymore um to in order to support ust and also um in addition they are not going to burn ust anymore uh, so what that means is they are going to abandon abandon UST as a whole. They are going to give it up. They are going to switch their focus to Terra Lunar. So what I'm going to do, uh, what I'm going to think is that they are not not only they are halting the printing of Terra Lunar to stop the severe lunar inflation, as they mentioned in the tweet. But they are also going to burn Terra Luna, going to burn Terra Luna. And I will, I'm almost certain that if they are going to give up UST, they are going to burn Terra Luna on an extremely, extremely, exceedingly large scale so that Terra Luna can reach one US dollar. That's my prediction. That's my prediction. They are going to replace UST by Terra Luna. That's what I would do. I'm uh, uh that was what I would uh, as a um as a crypto guy or a, a, a normal human being. That's what I would do. If you give up UST, you are going to replace it by something new. But they are going to replace it by just by Terra Luna. That's what I would guess because they are not going to publish a new coin. But because people would already have a bad image about it. But instead, if they are going to replace UST by Terra Luna and then burn it until it reach one dollar, they are going to win. They are going to win the crowd back. They're going to win the crowd back by doing so, but and then just give every UST holders one ter UST one Terra Luna, so they will, they're suddenly getting their money back also. So it would be an extremely extremely um, uh, 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 important event in the well. It's uh, it's also changing extremely fast. Uh, we will we'll have a uh, a certain a certain and extreme severe impact on the price of Terra Luna as well, and I would expect Duquan also. Um, he 
would not just stop burning Terra until it reached one dollar, because it's uh, he's already uh uh losing now sort of. So if I were him, why not just burn Terra Lunar until it reach maybe one Terra Lunar in the world? Just burn all the Terra Lunar uh, down and then until there is only one left. So if that were the case, if this were the case, I don't know if uh, he would go in the same that way, but if I were him, I would probably do so because that is the, the most fun thing to do. If I just burn all Terra until there is just one Terra left in the world. So um, it would just basically mean that, that, that Terra will have a price of almost infinity. Maybe one billion dollar per Terra So if you buy Terra right now, you basically turn from zero to a billionaire multi-billionaire if you hold more than one and um yeah that that would be the uh miracle sort of in the not in the crypto world but also in the history of mankind if dupont decided to do it then every bum in the every loser in the crypto world they are going to uh, switch the uh, uh become uh become the wells and then all the wells uh, are going to uh, get pulled, but the money will uh, come flow from the well. Um, I mean, the well from the other like USDT coins. They're going to flood the um, Terra Luna blockchain if two coins suddenly announce a trade, uh, a trade, uh, or UST official account or. Terra official account, they are going to announce such extreme burning event. And I'm going to say that they are going to do that because otherwise they are not going to uh, make it bad. They, they can't make it bad anyway, but if they're going to do that, that is a, is a very fun thing, uh, first of all. But the second thing is that it will just make the poor people uh, rich. Uh, by which I mean it would be extremely rich as well, and um, if like Terra Luna not only go, not only goes back to all time high, but it go, goes to one thousand, ten thousand, you know, one million per Terra Luna, and um, yeah, we are going to be the 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 the, the guy, the 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 the, uh, the wells, you know, you know, that's the. So this is the moment I would say, I have done that. I have, um, you know, I have even borrowed money to do that. You know, uh, although because I expected before on April sixth that um, it's a bear market, so I don't do much crypto. But and I also shot some crypto as well. But um, I, I don't make a lot of money. I but I save a lot of money, so. This is the moment that I want to go into right now. But for other cryptos, I'm not good that I, I still maintain a bearish uh, uh, sentiment on it on them. Uh, Ethereum probably, I would say that the money from Ethereum will flow to Terra Luna. So if I, if um, I have money to trade now, I will be shorting Ethereum and and longing Terra Luna. And um, I will just uh, hold Terra Luna until uh, Du Kuang, like, sort of, um, you know, I don't think he, um, I don't think he will be, uh, I mean, he, 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 he won't be a, a, a crypto main guy anymore, but uh, at least um, he can do something to, to the crypto community by doing uh, announcing such uh, burn, uh, such a scheme or such a plan and then everyone will love him although he won't be a uh, rich because I don't think uh, he because he lost his money money already uh, but and then the terrible pool has been diluted 
um, by the public uh, almost because when the price drop to almost zero, everyone going to flood in and the wells get out. So it's a it's a perfectly decentralized uh, crypt, uh, crypto. It's maybe the more most decentralized thing ever because every pool guy with a hundred bucks they're going to pull in, and if Luquan announced that they they're going to uh, kill the well and then make the pool guys rich, everyone will love it. So uh, that's my prediction. Thank you. Bye bye.